Welcome to Zentangle Project Pack number 16 and also the 2021 12 Days of Zentangle. My name is Rick. Hi, I'm Maria. And today we have with us Molly, who is going to uh, walk us through the unwrapping and introduction and get us all ready for this exciting dimensional project pack. Thanks for having me. Hi, Molly. This is fun. I, I think it's important for us to do these little preparation videos because it kind of gets everybody excited and maybe gets us familiar with some of the materials and maybe the, uh, the thought behind the theme of the project pack. And we always get, we get excited about every project pack, but I feel like we get like sort of extra excited um, this time of year with the 12 days because it's yes. just a little bit fun. And it's actually where this came from. Mm -hmm. we, uh, we did project packs. That's right. Um, the first one. Yeah, in the 12 days, I think, so. So tell us a little bit about, like, the inspiration behind this the, this uh, this particular one. Yeah, so the, the, the title of this um, project pack is called Keeping Score, and, and that's a little bit of a, a double meaning, shall mm -hmm. we say. But um, we are circling around a couple of new tools, but one of them is this... Um, I, I guess it's a scoring device, and can I open this? Yeah, up and sure. Show if them? you want to jump into it, yeah, you, I think we could do that. Um, but really, what we wanted to do was play around with um, looking at our tiles as potential three-dimensional works. Um, so even though we work um, two-dimensionally, how can we play around with maybe some subtle folds and um, ways to maybe glue them together um, to make these items that might hang or rock or maybe even a something we could interact with, which right. is kind of fun too. So we've sort of kept this as like a loose theme of us keeping score by <laughs> using a scoring device um, and really exploring very subtle things. The I think that we always come back to tangling on a, a, a flat surface, but then having the ability to make some fun things with mm. it. So Rick's pulled open our envelopes and we have um, some of the tools that we're gonna be using. And like we said, we have this really cool scoring device, which we're gonna be using to help manipulate um, the paper to fold easier. So that's kind of cool. And actually maybe playing around with a couple other ways that we can use that tool. Then we have some pretty um, basic tangling tools. We have um, two jelly rolls, a silver and a white, um, that we'll be using um, in different ways. And then the, um, the main pen we'll be using throughout is a Micron PN black pen. And then we have both a graphite pencil and a charcoal white with their corresponding tortillons. And then you also see a little brush there. And, and that brush is to use um, one of my favorite um, art supplies. I'm a huge fan of Mod Podge. I always have been. I think when I first discovered it, I may have Mod Podged everything I own. <laughs> um, I was like the decoupage queen. So being able to invite it into a Zentangle world is just um, such a thrill, and I hope everybody from Mod Podge is listening, and um, we can do some really cool Zentangle stuff out there. But um, Mod Podge is actually a glue and a sealer, and it just creates this really neat finished um, look to your tiles or dimensional objects, shall we say. Um, and it's really user-friendly, so that's kind of fun. And the sponge brush that we're using with it can be rinsed out and reused multiple times. Then we have our um, our envelope of tiles, and we just really have a nice collection of some bijou tiles, some zendalas, and some square tiles. And um, as always, with all of these materials, if you do not have a project pack, we encourage you to go out there and just use whatever you have at home um, and play around with how you can modify the lesson to work with whatever materials you do have. So have fun with it and enjoy. But in this project pack um, video, we really wanted to share with you a couple items we're going to be using that aren't in the project packs, right. right, Rick? So a lot of things that we're going to play with are things that we just found around our house. So Rick's clearing this stuff away. Right. And we have a little tray here of um, just a couple of like, yeah, mostly household items. But we thought we'd give you a heads up in case you needed to collect them. Well, the other thing is a lot of the stuff we, we didn't have to put in the project pack because you had it in the right. house, right? right? For we instance, a spoon. A spoon. Yeah. Right? And scissors. And, and thread, needle and thread. Scissors. We have some needle and thread. Mm -hmm. We have uh, some ribbon, or you can use like some cordage or or, or string. Yeah, heavy anything string. that would help you know hang something or add some. Maria uses a, a Q-tip at one point. Um, I use some 
uh, paper clips yeah, and I think some I used rubber bands. Because yep. the paper and clips are like the clamps. The, the clamps right? Yeah, those help. They actually work quite right. well, yeah. As does the rubber band, I think, in one of them. We use that like a clamp sort of And thing. we use <laughs> some uh, rattling things. Rattling yeah. things? Rattling <laughs> things. <laughs> Um, yeah, Thing, we, things to be rattled by. Yeah, right. let's not give it away too much. Oh, I, knew, I hadn't thought of the coffee, right, coffee beans. beans. Those are oh. beautiful. So this year I grew some sunflowers. So these are some sunflower seeds from the garden. We, uh, you could use coffee beans or you know dried beans, any or lentils, sort of dried beans. or anything lentils, like that. Little macaronis. Uh, Maria oh. uses some rice. <laughs> yeah. So all sorts of cool things, and then you know, I, I got oh, one more. I got yeah. one more. Ah, <laughs> two, oh, two nickels. nickels. Oh. They yes. have to be nickels or the size of a nickel. Approximately. Yeah, approximately, approximately sort of. which is two Kinda. centimeters. Is that it's what a, we It's about two centimeters, Across. and it's, a, it's about as thick as a nickel. And, uh, and we need two. And yeah. you need two. And I think we'll discover that oh, there are coins in other countries that work quite well. Right. Right. And we forgot one thing that's not on this tray. And that is blue tack. Blue tack, the mud, yeah. the this like little sticky putty that glues things together. Sort of right. like a, a silly putty-ish type thing. Yeah, yeah. it's it's B L U T A C, I think. Right. Blue tack, yeah. and you can get it online, or you can get it in hardware stores or, or craft stores. Right. And again, that might be something that once you see the video that we use it in, you will be like, oh, well, I can use right. this instead. So, as we go through mm -hmm. these videos, and you see. Um, us using a couple of different items, you will be like, oh, well, I easily have this, but it's not exactly what you're using. And I see Rick's pointing out right. the scrap paper. We have a scrap paper because at some point we'll be putting the tiles in between the paper and then getting some sort of massive book, <laughs> putting it in the book. To, for, and then, that's for gluing. That's yeah. for gluing. That's okay. our glue clamp. Yeah. But it's also, I needed one to trace... And cut. Right. So or, if or right. you could Project. use newspaper or, or a, uh, copy paper. And just just scrap paper. Scrap yeah. paper. So um, I think that's that's just Do about that. it. Thank and you. just have fun. And like Molly said, if you don't have this Project Pack materials, you probably have something that can make a mark. You probably have something that can make a dent in a paper. And, uh, and just play along and have fun and... Uh, and we always like to see what you all create. And, and sometimes you um, come up with some things that we had never thought of. And it's so exciting. Going beyond our expectations is, has been uh, right. such a, a, a one, wonderful gift that you give to us. And uh, we appreciate it so much. <laughs> yeah. So shall we Let, begin? Let's, let's get go. started. Let's do it. This Thank is you, a fun everybody. one. I love this. <laughs> okay. Bye, Bye now. Bye, guys.